In chemistry, Henry's law is a gas law that states that the amount of dissolved gas in a liquid is proportional to its partial pressure above the liquid. The proportionality factor is called Henry's law constant. It was formulated by the English chemist William Henry, who studied the topic in the early 19th century. In his publication about the number of gases absorbed by water, 1, he described the results of his experiments. Water takes up, of gas condensed by 1, 2, or more additional atmospheres, a quantity which, ordinarily compressed, would be equal to twice, thrice, and c, the volume absorbed under the common pressure of the atmosphere. An example where Henry's law is at play is in the depth dependent dissolution of oxygen and nitrogen in the blood of underwater divers that changes during decompression, leading to decompression sickness. An everyday example is given by one's experience with carbonated soft drinks, which contain dissolved carbon dioxide. Before opening, the gas above the drink in its container is almost pure carbon dioxide, at a pressure higher than atmospheric pressure. After the bottle is opened, this gas escapes, moving the partial pressure of carbon dioxide above the liquid to be much lower, resulting in degassing as the dissolved carbon dioxide comes out of solution. Fundamental types and variants of Henry's law constants There are many ways to define the proportionality constant of Henry's law, which can be subdivided into two fundamental types. One possibility is to put the aqueous phase into the numerator and the gaseous phase into the denominator. Aq, gas. This results in the Henry's law solubility constant H. Its value increases with increased solubility. Alternatively, numerator and denominator can be switched. Gas, Aq, which results in the Henry's law volatility constant K H display style K underscore room H. The value of K H display style K underscore room H decreases with increased solubility. There are several variants of both fundamental types. This results from the multiplicity of quantities that can be chosen to describe the composition of the two phases. Typical choices for the aqueous phase are molar concentration C A display style C underscore room A molality B display style B and molar mixing ratio X display style X. For the gas phase, molar concentration C G display style C underscore room G and partial pressure P display style P are often used. It is not possible to use the gas phase mixing ratio Y display style Y because at a given gas phase mixing ratio, the aqueous phase concentration C A display style C underscore room A depends on the total pressure and thus the ratio y c a display style y c underscore room a is not a constant to specify the exact variant of the henry's law constant two superscripts are used they refer to the numerator and the denominator of the definition for example h c p display style h caret cp refers to the henry solubility defined as c p display style c p topic henry's law solubility constants h display style h topic henry solubility defined via concentration H C P display style H caret C P atmospheric chemists often define the Henry solubility as H C P equals C A P display style H caret C P equals C underscore text A P here C A Display style C underscore text A is the concentration of a species in the aqueous phase, and P display style P is the partial pressure of that species in the gas phase under equilibrium conditions. The SI unit for H C P display style H caret C P 
is mol, m three par. However, often the unit m per atmosphere is used, since c a display style c underscore text a is usually expressed in m one m equals one mol per cubic decimeter, and p display style p in atm one atmosphere equals one hundred and one thousand three hundred and twenty five pascals equals Topic: The dimensionless Henry solubility. Equals H C C. Display style H caret C C. The Henry solubility can also be expressed as the dimensionless ratio between the aqueous phase concentration C A. Display style C underscore text up of a species and its gas phase concentration. C G display style C underscore text G H C C equals C A C G display style H carrot C C equals C underscore text A C underscore text G. For an ideal gas, the conversion is H C C equals H C P times R T display style H carrot C C equals H carrot C P times R T, where R display style I is the gas constant and T display style T is the temperature. Sometimes this dimensionless constant is called the Water air partitioning coefficient. K W A Display style K underscore text W A. It is closely related to the various, slightly different definitions of the Ostwald coefficient. L Display style L. As discussed by Battino, nineteen eighty four. Topic Henry solubility defined via aqueous phase mixing ratio H X P display style H caret X P another Henry's law solubility constant is H X P equals X P display style H caret X P equals X P here X display style X is the molar mixing ratio in the aqueous phase. For a dilute aqueous solution, the conversion between X display style X and C A display style C underscore text A is C A approximately equals X R H two O M H two O display style C underscore text a prox x frac varro underscore mathrum H underscore two O M underscore mathrum H underscore two O where R H two O display style varro underscore mathrum H underscore two O is the density of water in M H Two O display style m underscore mathrum h underscore two O is the molar mass of water. Thus, h x p approximately equals m h two O R H two O times h c P display style h caret x p approx frac m underscore mathrum h underscore two o varro underscore mathrum h underscore two o times h caret c p. The SI unit for h x p display style h caret x p is par minus one, although atm minus one is still frequently used. Topic. Henry solubility defined via molality 
H B P display style H caret B P. It can be advantageous to describe the aqueous phase in terms of molality instead of concentration. The molality of a solution does not change with T display style T since it refers to the mass of the solvent. In contrast, the concentration C display style C does change with T display style T since the density of a solution and thus its volume are temperature dependent. Defining the aqueous phase composition via molality has the advantage that any temperature dependence of the Henry's law constant is a true solubility phenomenon and not introduced indirectly via a density change of the solution. Using molality, the Henry solubility can be defined as H B P equals B P. Display style H caret B P equals B P. Here B display style B is used as the symbol for molality instead of M display style M to avoid confusion with the symbol M display style M for mass. The SI unit for H B P display style H caret B P is mole kilogram pa. There is no simple way to calculate H C P display style H caret C P from H B P display style H caret B P since the conversion between concentration C A display style C underscore text A and molality B display style B involves all solutes of a solution. For a solution with a total of n display style n solutes with indices i equals one n display style i equals one l dots n, the conversion is C A equals B R one plus I equals one N B I M I display style C underscore text R equals frac B varro one plus sum underscore I equals one carrot N B underscore I M underscore I where R display style varro is the density of the solution and M I Display style m underscore i are the molar masses. Here, b display style b is identical to one of the b i display style b underscore i in the denominator. If there is only one solute, the equation simplifies to c a equals b r one plus B M display style C underscore text A equals frac B varro one plus B M. Henry's law is only valid for dilute solutions where B M one display style B M L one and R approximately equals R H two O Display style varro approx varro underscore mathrm h underscore two o. In this case, the conversion reduces further to c a approximately equals b r h two o. Display style c underscore text a approx b varro underscore mathrm h underscore two o. And thus h P approximately equals H C P R H two O Display style H carrot BP approx H carrot CP varro underscore mathrm H underscore two O Topic The Bunsen coefficient Alpha Display style alpha 
According to Sazonov and Shaw, the dimensionless Bunsen coefficient alpha display style alpha is defined as the volume of saturating gas V1 reduced to T degree. Topic 273.15 K P degree. 1 bar, which is absorbed by unit volume 5 2 asterisk of pure solvent at the temperature of measurement and partial pressure of 1 bar. Quote, if the gas is ideal, the pressure cancels out, and the conversion to H C P is simply H C P equals alpha times 1 R T S T P display style H carrot C P equals alpha times frac one R T carrot text S T P with T S T P display style T carrot text S T P equals 273.15 K note that according to this definition the conversion factor is not temperature dependent. Independent of the temperature that the Bunsen coefficient refers to, 273.15 K is always used for the conversion. The Bunsen coefficient, which is named after Robert Bunsen, has been used mainly in the older literature. The Kunin coefficient S According to Sazonov and Shaw, the Kunin coefficient s display style s is defined as the volume of saturating gas V g reduced to T degree. Topic 273.15 K p degree bar, which is dissolved by unit mass of pure solvent at the temperature of measurement and partial pressure one bar. If the gas is ideal, the relation to H C P display style H carrot C P is H C P equals S times R R T S T P display style H carrot C P equals S times frac varo R T carrot text S T P where r display style varo is the density of the solvent and t stp display style t caret text stp equals 273.15 k the si unit for s display style s is cubic meter per kilogram the Kunin coefficient, which is named after Johannes Kunin, has been used mainly in the older literature, and IUPAC considers it to be obsolete. Topic: <laughs> Henry's law volatility constants. K H display style K underscore text H. Topic. The Henry volatility defined via concentration. K H P C display style K underscore text H carrot P C. A common way to define a Henry volatility is dividing the partial pressure by the aqueous phase concentration. K H P C equals P. C A equals one H C P display style K underscore text H carrot P C equals P C underscore text A equals one H carrot C P. The SI unit for K H P C display style K underscore text H carrot P C is par cubic meter per mole. Topic: The Henry volatility defined via aqueous phase mixing ratio. K H P X 
display style k underscore text h caret px. Another Henry volatility is k h p x equals p x equals one h x p. Display style k underscore text h caret p x equals p x equals one h caret x p. The SI unit for k h p x display style k underscore text h caret p x is par. However, ATM is still frequently used. Topic: The dimensionless Henry volatility. K H C C display style K underscore text H caret C C. The Henry volatility can also be expressed as the dimensionless ratio between the gas phase concentration C G display style C underscore text G of a species and its aqueous phase concentration. C A display style C underscore text A K H C C equals C G C A equals one H C C Display style K underscore text H carrot C C equals C underscore text G C underscore text A equals one H carrot C C. In chemical engineering and environmental chemistry, this dimensionless constant is often called the air water partitioning coefficient K or Display style K underscore text or Topic Values of Henry's law constants A large compilation of Henry's law constants has been published by Sander 2015. A few selected values are shown in the table below. Topic: <inaudible> Temperature dependence. When the temperature of a system changes, the Henry constant also changes. The temperature dependence of equilibrium constants can generally be described with the Van T Hoff equation, which also applies to Henry's law constants. D Lane H D one T equals minus Delta Sol H R Display style frac mathrum D Lane H mathrum D one T equals frac Delta underscore text Sol H R where Delta Sol H Display style delta underscore text sol h is the enthalpy of dissolution. Note that the letter h display style h in the symbol delta sol h display style delta underscore text sol h refers to enthalpy and is not related to the letter h display style h for Henry's law constants. Integrating the above equation and creating an expression based on H display style H carrot circ at the reference temperature T display style T carrot circ equals 298. 15 K yields H T equals H times EXP minus delta Sol H R one T minus one T Display style H T equals H carrot circ times EXP display style left frac delta underscore text sol H R left frac one T frac one T carrot circ right right. The Van T Hoff equation in this form is only valid for a limited temperature range in which Delta Sol H display style delta underscore text sol H does not change much with temperature. The following table lists some temperature dependencies. 
solubility of permanent gases usually decreases with increasing temperature at around room temperature. However, for aqueous solutions, the Henry's law solubility constant for many species goes through a minimum. For most permanent gases, the minimum is below 120 degrees Celsius. Often, the smaller the gas molecule and the lower the gas solubility in water, the lower the temperature of the maximum of the Henry's law constant. Thus, the maximum is at about 30 degrees Celsius for helium, 92 to 93 degrees Celsius for argon, nitrogen and oxygen, and 114 degrees Celsius for xenon. Topic. Effective Henry's law constants HEF The Henry's law constants mentioned so far do not consider any chemical equilibria in the aqueous phase. This type is called the «intrinsic» or «physical» Henry's law constant. For example, the intrinsic Henry's law solubility constant of formaldehyde can be defined as H C P equals C H 2 CO P H 2 CO Display style H carrot C E C P equals frac C C E H 2 CO P C E H 2 CO In aqueous solution, methanol is almost completely hydrated, H 2 CO plus H 2 O minus minus H 2 C O 2 Display style C E H 2 CO plus H 2 O H 2 carbon dihydroxide The total concentration of dissolved methanol is C tot equals C H 2 CO plus C H two C O two Display style C underscore C E tot equals C C E H two C O plus C C E H two carbon dihydroxide. Taking this equilibrium into account, an effective Henry's law constant H F Display style H underscore C E F can be defined as H F equals C tot P H two C O equals C H two C O plus C H two C O two P H two CO Display style H underscore C E F equals frac C underscore C E tot P C E H two C O equals frac C C E H two C O plus C C E H two carbon dihydroxide P C E H two C O For acids and bases, the effective Henry's law constant is not a useful quantity because it depends on the pH of the solution. In order to obtain a pH independent constant, the product of the intrinsic Henry's law constant H C P Display style H carrot C E C P and the acidity constant K A Display style K underscore C E A is often used for strong acids like hydrochloric acid, hydrogen chloride H equals H C P times K A equals C H plus times C C L minus P hydrogen chloride. Display style H equals H carrot C E C P times K underscore C E A equals frac C C E H plus times C C E C L carrot P C E hydrogen chloride. Although H display style H is usually also called a Henry's law constant. It should be noted that it is a different quantity and it has different units than H C P display style H caret C E C P. Topic: Dependence on ionic strength. Session of equation. Values of Henry's law constants for aqueous solutions depend on the composition of the solution, i.e., on its ionic strength and on dissolved organics. In general, the solubility of a gas decreases with increasing salinity. Salting out. However, a salting in 
Effect has also been observed, for example for the effective Henry's law constant of glyoxyl. The effect can be described with the Sessionov equation, named after the Russian physiologist Ivan Sessionov sometimes the German transliteration Sechenau", of the Cyrillic name Sessinov is used. There are many alternative ways to define the Sessionov equation, depending on how the aqueous phase composition is described based on concentration, molality, or molar fraction and which variant of the Henry's law constant is used. Describing the solution in terms of molality is preferred because molality is invariant to temperature and to the addition of dry salt to the solution. Thus, the Sessionov equation can be written as log H 0 B P H B P equals K S times B salt Display style log left frac h underscore zero carrot bp h carrot bp right equals k underscore text s times b text salt where h zero b p display style h underscore zero carrot bp is the Henry's law constant in pure water h b p display style h carrot bp is the Henry's law constant in the salt solution? K S display style K underscore text S is the molality based Sessionov constant and B salt display style B text salt is the molality of the salt. Topic: Non-ideal solutions. Henry's law has been shown to apply to a wide range of solutes in the limit of infinite dilution x0 including non-volatile substances such as sucrose. In these cases, it is necessary to state the law in terms of chemical potentials. For a solute in an ideal dilute solution, the chemical potential depends only on the concentration. For non-ideal solutions, the activity coefficients of the components must be taken into account. μ equals μ c plus R T lane gamma C C C display style mu equals mu underscore C carrot circ plus R T lane frac gamma underscore C C C carrot circ where gamma C equals K H C P Display style gamma underscore c equals frac k underscore text h c p caret asterisk. For a volatile solute, c degree equals one mole per liter. For non-ideal solutions, the activity coefficient gamma c depends on the concentration and must be determined at the concentration of interest. The activity coefficient can also be obtained for non-volatile solutes, where the vapor pressure of the pure substance is negligible by using the Gibbs-Duhem relation. I n I D mu I equals zero. Display style sum underscore I and underscore I D mu underscore I equals zero. By measuring the change in vapor pressure and hence chemical potential of the solvent, the chemical potential of the solute can be deduced. The standard state for a dilute solution is also defined in terms of infinite dilution behavior. Although the standard concentration C degree is taken to be 1 mole, L by convention, the standard state is a hypothetical solution of 1 mole, L in which the solute has its limiting infinite dilution properties. This has the effect that all non-ideal behavior is described by the activity coefficient. The activity coefficient at 1 mole, L is not necessarily unity, and is frequently quite different from unity. All the relations above can also be expressed in terms of molalities B rather than concentrations, e.g. μ equals mu b plus r t lane gamma b b b display style mu equals mu underscore b caret circ plus r t lane frac gamma underscore b b b caret circ where gamma b equals k h B P 
display style gamma underscore b equals frac k underscore text h b p caret asterisk for a volatile solute b degree equals one mole per kilogram. The standard chemical potential mu m degree, the activity coefficient gamma m, and the Henry's law constant kH b all have different numerical values when molalities are used in place of concentrations. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Solvent mixtures. Henry law constant H two m for a gas two in a mixture of solvents one and three is related to the constants for individual solvents H twenty one and H twenty three. Lane H two M equals X one Lane H twenty one plus X three Lane H twenty three minus a thirteen X one X three Display style lane H underscore two M equals X underscore one lane H underscore twenty one plus X underscore three lane H underscore twenty three and underscore thirteen X underscore one X underscore three where A thirteen is the interaction parameter of the solvents from wall expansion of the excess chemical potential of the ternary mixtures. Topic Miscellaneous In geochemistry In geochemistry, a version of Henry's law applies to the solubility of a noble gas in contact with silicate melt. One equation used is C melt C gas equals EXP minus beta mu melt E minus mu gas e display style c underscore text melt c underscore text gas equals exp left beta mu underscore text melt caret text e mu underscore text gas caret text e right where c is the number concentrations of the solute gas in the melt and gas phases beta equals 1 kbt an inverse temperature parameter kb is the boltzmann constant Micro E is the excess chemical potentials of the solute gas in the two phases. Topic: <laughs> Comparison to Raoult's law. Henry's law is a limiting law that only applies for sufficiently dilute solutions. The range of concentrations in which it applies becomes narrower the more the system diverges from ideal behavior. Roughly speaking, that is the more chemically different the solute is from the solvent. For a dilute solution, the concentration of the solute is approximately proportional to its mole fraction x, and Henry's law can be written as P equals K H x display style P equals K underscore text H x This can be compared with Raoult's law P equals P x Display style p equals p caret asterisk x, where p asterisk is the vapor pressure of the pure component. At first sight, Raoult's law appears to be a special case of Henry's law, where kH equals p asterisk. This is true for pairs of closely related substances, such as benzene and toluene, which obey Raoult's law over the entire composition range. Such mixtures are called ideal mixtures. The general case is that both laws are limit laws, and they apply at opposite ends of the composition range. The vapor pressure of the component in large excess, such as the solvent for a dilute solution, is proportional to its mole fraction, and the constant of proportionality is the vapor pressure of the pure substance Raoult's law. The vapor pressure of the solute is also proportional to the solute's mole fraction, but the constant of proportionality is different and must be determined experimentally Henry's law. In mathematical terms, Raoult's law lim x 1 p x equals P Display style lim underscore x to one left frac P x right equals P carrot asterisk Henry's law Lim x zero P 
x equals k h display style lim underscore x to zero left frac p x right equals k underscore text h Raoult's law can also be related to non-gas solutes. Topic. See also. Pervaporation. Partition coefficient. Ration of concentrations in a mixture at equilibrium. Sieverts's law. Graham's law. Henry adsorption constant. Raoult's law, a law of thermodynamics for vapor pressure of a mixture.